Pisces. Welcome to Tarot Readings by Roxby. I hope you guys are all doing well. This is going to cover the next two weeks from March 4th to March 17th, 2019. And for weekly readings, you guys could definitely feel free to check out Facebook Live every Wednesday for each additional sign. So this is going to be for Pisces, Sun, Moon, and Rising signs. And Pisces, those of you that are celebrating birthdays, I hope you guys have a very beautiful, blessed, happy birthday. I'm using Wheel of the Year. Amazing deck. And Pisces, just keep in mind, especially those of you that are new, you know, thank you so much for subscribing to the channel. I truly appreciate all of you so, so much. You know, I'm reading for a lot of you. If it doesn't resonate, definitely feel free to check out your other signs. Pisces, Spirit, Sun, Moon, and Rising Signs. March 4th to the 17th, 2019. The Pisces. Pisces, those of you that would like to get a private reading, follow me on Facebook, Instagram, Instant Go. Links to everything that you guys need are right below the video in the description box. Oops. So that's going to be your overall energy. And at the bottom of the deck, okay, the page of wands. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy, but that's you no know, exciting communication. It's coming in for you. And then your overall energy is the Eight of Cups. So, you know, you're walking away from something that's emotionally no longer serving you. You know, looking out to the future, just moving forward. It's possible some of you could be emotionally moving forward. For others of you, you know, physically moving forward, leaving the past behind. But you're definitely starting something new with the magician here. Virgo, Gemini energy. But, you know, manifesting something, having all the tools, all the resources that you need to be successful with starting or creating something new for yourself. Some of you definitely are going to be receiving communication that allows for you to be able to manifest something. You have the Page of Cups. You guys have three pages in this reading. I just realized that. Lots of communication. You know, in this sitting right next to the Magician, I love this. This could definitely be that exciting communication that's allowing you to start something new. You know, you have three pages in this spread. Lots of communication. Good news. And then you have the Knight of Pentacles. You know, and the Page of Wands, you know, the Page of Cups, you know, the Page of Swords. Let's start. Yeah, let's go here. The Page of Swords is under the Magician. You know, I feel like for some of you, you know, someone definitely could be like watching out for you, you know, maybe spying, but I don't really, I don't really feel that. I feel like somebody's, you know looking out after you. It can also be delays with communication. I 
there definitely could be some, you know, confusion surrounding this situation. Whatever it is that you're manifesting, I do strongly see you desiring this communication that allows for you to move forward. Or that allows for you to manifest something new with your life. You literally have everything that you need to do this with the magician. And I really feel like it's, it really is this communication that you're waiting on. For some of you, I feel like this is related to career. For others of you, it's related to a relationship. And I do feel like you're very focused on your hopes, your wishes, your dreams, your desires. Focused on the future and moving forward towards new beginnings. You know, even, you know, with the Seven of Cups... You know, you're ready for transformation. You're ready for change. You know, you're ready to just take off and go. Some of you definitely are taking your time. Or maybe someone else is. Maybe you're dealing with an earth sign. You really could be dealing with any sign here, really. You know, but if you're a Pisces with earth in your chart, you could be taking your time. Moving forward at a much slower pace. But I definitely see you moving towards this new beginning. No matter what, this night you know, is looking directly over at the magician. And the Page of Cups. So for some of you, this is, I think, I feel like this has been an ongoing in a process, but you're definitely moving toward being able to start something new. You know, this is the definitely the slowest moving night, no doubt, but the only one that's always successful. So you will reach your goal, Pisces. You're definitely manifesting something new. And for some of you, it's been a little bit of a process, slowly but surely, definitely happening. It's not happening quickly or suddenly. You know, patience is also needed. You do have strength. Sign of Leo. You know, this is having that inner strength. It's about control, being patient. And I think you're planning and going over the details you know, planning for your future. Now, this is interesting. The Three of Cups. If you're resonating with this reading on, on the love front, you know, there could be a friend around you, Pisces. I'm just not seeing it as a three party. I'm just not. There definitely could be a friend around you that you might have a strong connection with them. Definitely. The Two of Cups is right underneath this. It rep represents reciprocated love, very strong, deep bond. You know, this could be some of you, you know, moving forward slowly. Possibly even moving slowly with approaching this person, them, you. with an offer, you know, with the Knight of Pentacles, you know, and it could definitely be someone that you're friends with, possibly a Leo, an Earth sign, Virgo Taurus, Capricorn. I just feel like you're slowly approaching something. Whether this is an offer from another person, it could be an offer coming in for some of you. Maybe you're not offering someone. Maybe, you know, there is a friend around you that's interested in you. And this person could be offering you something. If you're already in a committed relationship, it really is going to be a beautiful time for you. There's a lot of emotional energy here. You could be getting out and about, spending a lot of time with your partner, friends, family, you know, as well. But it really does look like a great two weeks. 
you know, for love, connecting with, with another person on a more emotional level. You know, it's reciprocated love. It's beautiful. Some of you could be waiting on communication from another person, whether it is romantic, business, it could be a friendship, family relationship. But there's another person here. Definitely. Could be, you know, a friend. You could be waiting on a friend to communicate with you. Waiting on an offer. Could be an offer for a new job. You know, I definitely see you moving forward. Now, for some of you, this possibly could be you moving up within the, within your career. There's a lot of movement here, Pisces. And maybe you've been waiting on communication. But I feel like, you know, you're expecting it. This communication. You're receiving an offer. With strength here, you could literally, literally, you could be taking the bull by the horns and just going for it. And I do feel this more towards the end of the second week. There, there's a lot of amazing energy here, Pisces, especially with the magician, you know, this being your first card out, you're manifesting a new beginning, creating something new. And for some of you, it really is a big love. Three pages, lots of communication. It really is a beautiful, beautiful reading. I'm going to grab you guys an Oracle card. Healing with the Angels. Messages from the angels. I'm sorry. Messages from the angels. By Doreen Virtue. Additional guidance for Pisces. What else does Pisces need to know? March 4th to the 17th. Spirit will need for Pisces. Okay, that's it. Wow. Oh my gosh, Pisces. I never pull this card for people. New romance is imminent either with a newcomer or through a reignited passion in your existing relationship. Be open to giving and receiving. Chantel. That is just beautiful. Totally. And it really could be a friend. Someone that you already know. Virgo does come through strong. Leo. But definitely beautiful. Guys, if it didn't resonate, definitely feel free to watch your other signs. But amazing reading. Absolutely amazing. Happy birthday, Pisces. Guys, absolutely love you. I will see you back here soon. Take care. Bye.